Elliot from the Bear Pit TV doing the preferred 11 for tonight's game against Liverpool. Craig's taking a break. Sling your up, Craig. It's me. I'm doing it. I'm picking the team. And I'm going to pick the team based on what I want to see. Not what I think Mark Hughes is going to do, because I know what Mark Hughes is going to do pretty much. But I'm going to give what I want to see. Okay? That's what we're going to do. Obviously, we're coming off the back of the loss against Crystal Palace. I think we were the better side in that game. But again, just our defensive duties let us down. We can't seem to defend for Toffee. We just... You know, we're just leaking goals at the minute. We can score up the other end and score a couple, but we're just conceding more. And that's the problem at the minute. That's the problem that it seems to have been for the past two years for Mark Hughes. And obviously we need to stop that and cut it out if he wants to stay in a job. And it's, we're coming up against, you know, Liverpool, one of the free scorers in the league tonight. So we're really going to be put to the test. So this is going to be my side. I don't think Mark Hughes is going to play it, but this is what I'd like to see. Obviously, I'm going to stick with the 3-4-3 because I don't think that's ever changing anytime soon. Mark Hughes seems pretty uh, rigid with that. It doesn't seem to like to change it much. So, obviously, Grant's going to start in that. It's going to be a back three of Shawcross, Zuma and Wimmer. I'm going to put Bruno Martin Zindi out as a right wing back because I think Mamadouf just isn't a right wing back, unfortunately. Uh, I would start him elsewhere, but for this game, I'm just going to give him a little rest. I know he's got that elbow injury, niggling elbow injury as well, which seems to be giving him a bit of jip. Uh, left wing back, I'm going to put Josh Timmon. Obviously throwing him in at the deep end. He's, pl he's played Premier League games before. He's had eight or so for Hull last season. I know he'd be up against Salah. But you know what? I don't want Eric Peters up against Salah. I'll tell you that now. So I'm going to put Josh Timmon in at left wing back. Uh, and then I'm going to give the midfield of Fletcher. And I'm going to stick with those guys. They've obviously been doing it for a couple of... Well, for the majority of the season now. So I'm going to stick with them in midfield. On the right, it's obviously Shakiri. There can't be anyone else who goes there. He's been our star man this season. I'm quite worried about January and also if he performs at the World Cup because I think other suitors will be knocking on the door to take him to maybe European football, which I know he he, he reaches for and that's what he wants to be playing in. And I can obviously I can honestly see that happening. Uh, up front, for me, it's going to be Hesse. I don't think Chupo is ready for that right striker role. I don't think he's a striker. I think he's more of a winger and I'm going to put him on the left. I've seen him do much better when he's put out in wide positions than up top and leading the line. Uh, he's very good and nimble on his feet. He links up well with the rest of the players and I'm going to put him there. I'm going to put him on the left and give a uh, drop Ramin Amsobi, who's been a bit indifferent in those uh, past couple of games out on the left wing, I feel. But Chupo, I've got no doubt of the quality he's got. He obviously showed that with his goals against Manchester United. He scored against Brighton uh, last week. And for me... I just want him out on the wing. I want to see him in what I think is his natural position and see what he can do. And I'm going to go with Hesse up top. The reason I'm going with Hesse is he's been out of the side for a while now. I think he was dropped after one of his better performances. Um, and I know his head might be elsewhere with obviously his young son who's, in, uh, who's not very well. And you know some of the other problems he's got at the minute maybe adapting to the English game. But for me... He came on last week against Crystal Palace. He looked very bright. And I want to see what he can do from the start. Obviously, he had that great game at home against Arsenal. Hopefully, he can do it today against Liverpool if he is to start. Obviously, we've got Peter Crouch and Mamadou for his options there for strikers as well to bring on. Maybe Mamadou on the right. Could bring Shaq in central a bit. And obviously, we've got Peter Crouch to come on for the last 20 or 25 minutes. And obviously, he signed his new deal this week. And he's not going anywhere anytime soon. So, that is my preferred 11 to run through it again. Grant in, at the back. Shawcross, Zuma and Wimmer in the... Uh, in the in the back in the back three uh, Bruno Martins Indy right wing back I'm going to put Timon left back Fletcher and Allen in the middle Shaq on the right Chupo on the left and it's going to be Hesse up top for me let me know what you think about my team obviously I've changed it a little bit from what Cray uh, would usually do uh, so do leave your comments below let me know if you agree let me know if you think I'm a raving lunatic I would love to hear them do make sure you like this video subscribe comment and we'll see you later